Hi friends, this is Susie, your gaming guru. If you find these videos helpful, I would ask that you consider liking and subscribing. So here we are on level 6098 in Candy Crush Saga, where we have 25 moves to collect three ingredients. Here they are. They need to get here. So we've got a lot of blockers in the way, including the sugar chests themselves. And then we've got frosting in the sugar chests. Not so good. I've got some licorice locks and a conveyor belt, but I do have some good things on the board. I've got some specials that if we can ignite them, they can blow up and collect some of those keys we have here. Unfortunately, I've got a limited field and five different colors, and that makes it so that oftentimes I don't have a whole lot of different options on this board. I just have to take what is available but I'll start looking more closely for those options instead of playing very quickly like I have been. Let's go for considered instead of intuitive choices here. All right, let's see. Nothing great. I could take out a layer here, or I could take this out entirely, which is what I'll do because then it's more space for candy. I could make a stripe here, or I could just strike this directly. I tend to prefer striking things directly, but this stripe in this case can have an impact across the board. So I'm going to choose that. Ooh, now look at this. Now we've got some wrapped candies that may help. Although a combo is better. Let's see if I can. Mm, things are sliding out, but I like this combo. It reaches really all of the keys. So now this is open. We've got a UFO. I didn't even notice him down there. And we can, if these fall onto a conveyor belt, we can drop these anywhere that there's a column that reaches the bottom. And since there's a conveyor belt, it's not likely to get stuck anywhere. But now we have to get them off this ledge, and I hadn't considered how difficult that part was going to be. Although we did have to collect those keys to get this open. Uh, I like color bomb, color bomb combos, don't you? Hmm, shoot. Well, it does take off a layer of everything, but only one layer. Maybe I can combo with something else. Maybe, possibly. Yikes. Uh, to try to make even greater impact. That's what I'm looking to do. Now the question is, do I have enough blue to make this worthwhile? And I'm just not sure that's the case. So what if I, well, if I take out this green, this drops down, but then we've got this corner to come around. That doesn't work very well. What if I were to, to just remove a color? What if I remove green and try to still put this together? Well, unfortunately, this drops off into really bizarre places. Oops, hello. I just don't know that that's going to work very well for us. I think I'm going to do this and go for a bit of hopeful cascading and try to get more blue lined up to help. Still not a lot of blue. Let's take this out. This is going away, this opportunity. But I feel like orange is the color to remove here. Let's go ahead and take out orange and see what happens. I'm okay that I didn't get to pair those up. It just didn't seem like really a worthwhile opportunity. So here's this guy. I still need to clear these things out. Now I'll put this together. Now I've got a lineup that's much better, much more helpful. Okay. I'm going to drop this in, and then I've got this wrapped candy. Hold on, I think I've got it. Wow, this was circuitous. I did not play this well, and yet I still got there in the end. I didn't play the beginning as well as I might have because I was just playing instinctively, not really looking for ways to take out those keys. Thankfully, those keys came together. And then at the end... I think I held on to things for too long. I should have at least used one of those color bombs to try to knock things out. Sometimes when I wait for the right opportunity, I just end up with no opportunities. Thankfully, it worked out for me. So I admit I got some luck on this. But remember that when you play intuitively, all of that previous knowledge that you've learned from 
losing boards before can come into play. So I hope the, the best of luck for you. If you have any questions or comments, please put those below. And as always, thank you so much for watching.